I just want to ask this right quick. What do y'all think? Your last name is Jones, right? Now, you know all the Joneses that you know of, and the one that you gave birth to if you're female, and that the one that you contribute to in reference to making a baby that you know of. But what about those other Joneses? You know what just popped in my head? What if... Your name goes all the way down, not only before you was born, but before your mother was born, before your grandmother was born, before your great-grandmother was born. What if it goes all the way down to slavery and maybe prior to that? I don't know whether there was, no, I don't think there was any American names like last name Joneses back in Moses' days or whatever. But I think they... They capture their culture and their names. Well, should I say they capture their names and keep their legend or legion. What's that? Your lineage, your bloodline, keep going on and on based on the fact of that male son from within that family have children and keep making the male and making the male and making the male. So just think if your Joneses was all the way back to, I don't know, no famous Joneses or whatever kind of Jones that was back in the days of 1919 and 1910 and all that stuff. After death, who is to say that you was related to these people? That that bloodline was never broken. And when we think about it, I'm thinking about it now. That's, maybe that's why God couldn't use no one from earth within a bloodline to break the bondage of sin. Because bloodlines go on forever. As people call generational curses go on forever. Bad blood go on forever. So maybe God didn't want his name to be tainted. So he used the spiritual realm, the aspect of the spiritual, the aspect of the spiritual part to come down and redeem us. So there's somebody that's name of Wilson that I'm watching right now. And I was thinking like, okay, and she kind of like is big and singing. So I'm like, you know what? We, we got Wilson in our family that's singers. We got Glovers that's in, our, that's, fam that's in our families as singers, you know. And even though it's in the marriage, Right, let's say somebody marry into a Wilson or marry into a Glover or marry into a, well, I ain't going to say a Mingo. Yeah, marry into a Mingo, right? Because Bishop Mingo married into a Mingo, right? So mommy married, ma mommy married into a Wilson, but she was originally a Glover. So even though my last name is Wilson, I have Glover blood in me. And my father is a Wilson based on his father's side, right? But because mommy birthed him, right, he got some Glover in him. So now we go run into somebody that's a Glover way later on in life. That Glover could still be connected to us. We just don't know how. I mean, we don't know the whole full uh, uh, bloodline to say that this person is related to us. But maybe in the reality of things, the names just go on through generation to generation like it was back in God's days, right? The, 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 the bloodline go on, the name line go on, but it just becomes separated because we don't know where the name came from. Am I making sense? So I just thought I'd just... 
<laughs> it ain't nothing bad. I mean, ain't nothing big, but I just thought I'd just put that out there. What y'all think? Do y'all think that too? Do y'all think that y'all name run all the way back to 219? 219. To 1919 or 1817? Do you know somebody or your grandparents told you or somebody that was that they was related to that was born back then. My grandma was born in 1901. So who's to say? Who's a Glover from 1901 up until today? Whether that person is alive or not, the bloodline still goes on. There's somebody still living from that. Well, I won't say from that time. Okay, you got 1919. Then... Let's say it's 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 my grandmother. My grandma was born nineteen oh one, either nineteen oh one or nineteen oh four. So whenever she had her children, right? You see what I'm saying? Her children made children. Well, as far as I know, my father only had me, my sister, and my brother. Right? But I don't know who who was connected to his grandmother, which was, I mean, his mother, which is my grandmother. So her name could go all the way, all the way. You know, she was a slave, but what about her mother before she was born? Her mother was a slave. You see what I'm saying? Her her father was a slave. My grandmother, mother and father were slaves, right? So we don't know who was on the father's side. That's my great great grandmother so i never met my great great grandfather so who is to say how far down his name go that could be of some connection who is to say that some of these celebrities and these actors and these artists these musicians who is to say that they ain't related to you or i or, or, or the next person we don't know we just know about our immediate stuff and we only know what people tell us so i just throw that out